Hi everyone, I just want to give you a quick tour of the course website. So of course you go to mycourses.cnm.edu and you sign in with your CNM username and password and then you find the link to your course. And once you do that, you'll come to a site that looks kind of like this. And what you want to do is go to coursework. So that's your kind of home base. Coursework and then content. And that will take you to the content of the course. So if we look over here on the left hand side of the screen, we'll note a few things. At the top we see the overview and syllabus. So you can find the syllabus there. But an even better place to go really is course resources. And if you click here, these are all links, you'll come to a series of links here. Um, and so you get the course description, the welcome message, the syllabus, and the due dates. So it'll be good to review these things before you get started. You don't have to memorize everything, just get a sense of what the course is all about. Um, so for example, these are all links. If I click on due dates, all the course due dates will pop up. And you can punch these in your calendar or into your phone or whatever method you use to keep yourself on track. It's also good to use these breadcrumbs here as opposed to the back arrow. So let's just click on Table of Contents and we'll go back to the Table of Contents. So we just looked at Course Resources and we can scroll down. And if we do that, we can see that there are a number of modules. So here's the Week 1 module right here. And then here's the Week 2 module and you can see the dates for them right there as well. So these are also links, so let's click on the week one module, and that'll take us here uh, to week one, what is anthropology. And then if you scroll down, you'll see the things that you need to do for this week, right? So the course week begins on Monday and ends on a Sunday. Um, and then down here, you have the things that are due. And if you scroll down even more, you can see uh, some more resources. So there's the textbook, there's some um, videos that you can watch, and then here we have the discussion forum and the syllabus quiz. So let's just start with the syllabus quiz first. So you'll just click on this link. That'll take you to this page which shows you the parameters for the quiz. So it's actually 2 a.m. that I'm making this <laughs> right here, you can see. Um, and then it has the due date, and then here you have the time is unlimited, okay? And unlimited attempts. So, and I've already taken this, but um, normally it'll say uh, start down here and you just click on that button and that will take you to the quiz. And then here's the syllabus quiz and I'm just gonna answer randomly. These aren't the actual answers. And then once you're done, you just go ahead and select submit quiz if you've forgotten a question, it'll give you a warning and you can go back to that question and answer it, which is kind of nice. And then submit the quiz and then it'll give you another chance because once you submit it, you can't really go back. In Brightspace, you, it's, it's hard to kind of undo the submit quiz. So then you hit the submit and then it'll show at least for the syllabus quiz all the all the uh, questions and all the answers, okay? Okay, so let's go back to our week one module and then we'll try a forum. So here's the forum one and these again are links. You click on the link. There's a few steps here, okay? So here is the discussion question. You actually have to click on this as well to take you to the actual place where you can submit a post. Okay? So then you read these instructions carefully and then you come down here to the bottom and it says start a new thread. And you just click on that and you start a new thread. And then go ahead and post. So if this is someone's post, in order to reply to it, you actually have to click on it and then select reply to thread and then compose your reply and then select post again. So now I'll show you how to submit a written assignment. So we have a few uh, film responses in this course. So again, you go to coursework and content and that will bring you to this page. 
And then I'll scroll down to week four where we have our first film response. So here's the week four kind of cover page with what you're supposed to do and when it's due. And if we scroll down, we can see that there's some film response one instructions right here. And so if you click on that, it will take you to the instructions. So just read these instructions carefully and write your response in a Word document or uh, you can submit it as a PDF. And then when you're ready to submit, you can come back here to the module, find Film Response 1, submit your assignment here, click on that, and then it's just as simple as like attaching a document to an email. You come down here to Upload, you find a file, open it, and then it will attach it right here so you know that it's linked up to this submission. And then scroll down, find the Submit button, and then just select Submit. And then once you've done that, it takes me about a week to grade. Uh, you can come into My Grades right here in what's called the Nav Bar. And then go to Grades. And then you can see like we have a score of 10 out of 10 for the syllabus quiz and then the percentage here 100%. I don't have any other grades. Oh, here I've got a 50 out of 60 for the midterm. You can also send an email by selecting this envelope right here. You can send an instant message or an email. You just click on email and this won't stay in Brightspace. It'll actually go to your CNM Outlook account and then you just compose your email as normal. You can also select instant message. The person doesn't have to be online, but they will get like a pop-up alert um, like this uh, after they log in. Okay, I think that should get you started for now. Um, best of luck, and as always, if you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to me. Okay, happy learning. Talk to you later. Bye.